four of the greatest solo players. 100 hours of gameplay on one official server. This is the tale of Blueprint, Frost, Hjune, and me, as we each take on our own solo adventure and go head to head for progression. 50 hours in, and we each have created our own unique fortresses. But who will be the last solo standing? And what would happen when these four players unite against one common enemy? I guess you'll just have to wait and see. So sit back, relax, and I hope you enjoy. The time was 3pm BST, exactly 44 hours from the beginning of this Rust adventure. With over 50 hours left to go, this story was far from over. Frost, Blueprint and Hjune were fast asleep, and so I would use this time to get a head start and get to work farming. Oh no, my externals are decaying, that is not good. Ooh, there's someone else farming. Oh, I need to somehow get up to there. Oh! Oh, bastard! My legs! Farmer's gotta be around here somewhere. He cannot have got far. There's another one up here, but this isn't him, because the guy I heard had a jackhammer. Mm, yeah, that was not the same guy. Oh well, he had a little bit of farm. Oh shit! Oh. Okay, listen, listen. <laughs> that was my warm up, okay? I've just woken up. Oh, we got him. Oh! Okay! Uh, I guess we start the day off by farming the farmers. My word, I can't even. I. Ah! <laughs> I'm getting the hell out of here. This is like one of those, so I did some farming off camera <laughs> moments. After a rather quick farming run, I'd managed to get all the resources I would need to last me a couple of hours. In the day ahead, I had some big plans and was likely going to make some enemies. It was therefore important that I spend some time building my shooting floor. If I would need to, say, defend my base. Alright, let's get these electric furnaces loaded up. I want to start smelting down lots of my sulfur too, because I want to do some big raids today. That sulfur would end up being incredibly important, but not for the raids I initially had in mind. Right, the electric furnaces have been great, but I'm just going to start smelting wood down in normal furnaces, because I'm going to need a lot of charcoal. I have so much sulfur farmed, but for gunpowder, I'm going to need so much more charcoal. Right, that should be plenty of upkeep for my externals. Space actually doesn't take too much, but when I'm going to build this shooting floor, the upkeep is going to go up quite a bit. I think an auto turret right there will be lethal. Something to cover the door to my core and my inner peak downs. I think this one is going to be very worthwhile. Okay, how do I want to do this roof? I want to be able to take heli. But I also want to have another bedroom up here, because I think just having loads of bedrooms is important. I also want, like, another shooting floor on the top. I don't know, I've got this vision in my head of what I want this base to be. Okay, you know what, I think I'll make this floor, like, a very normal shooting floor, with just the kind of normal external door peaks. But then I'll make another roof on the very top, which can be, like, the heli tower. Okay, so I can have a door there that leads to my shooting floor, and then another one mirrored on this side. And then I could have my bedrooms in these squares here. Mm, yeah, this will work. This will work. And then windows all the way along here. And then the same on the other side. Wait, I've got it! I'm gonna make this a triangle ladder hatch, and then this can lead, like, up to my- Wait, what's it? There we go. And then this can lead up to my, like, heli tower. Yes! Oh man, this is using up so much stone. Thank gosh for that, uh, kind donation from that stranger earlier. So 
So above each of these ladder hatches, I want to build a really tall tower. So I'm going to extend this up. I think two full blocks, I think, would be good. Where's that raid? That's not Blueprint, is it? Wait, is Blueprint getting raided? No, I think that might be a bit further away, I think. See, I was in the process of building the biggest base amongst the four of us solos. But how did I do it? How have I outprogressed three of the best solos out there? Well, what really separates me, I think, is my smooth balls thanks to Manscaped, today's sponsor. <laughs> I can't keep doing that, man. And in case you've forgotten, Father's Day is right around the corner. <laughs> You're welcome. And while the Lawnmower 4.0 is the absolute perfect gift for your dad, I actually won't be buying it for mine. Why? Because being my biggest fan, he's actually already bought the Manscaped Perfect Package using my code Wiljum. That was over a year ago now, and he still uses it, and it's got the Wiljum Dad seal of approval. Especially the Lawnmower 4.0, a sleek trimmer perfect for both beard and body hair. With cutting edge skin safe technology to reduce any nicks and cuts to your bits, as well as a cordless smart waterproof design. It's safe to say that, like mine, your dad will love it. And while you're there, why not give Manscaped's Weed Whacker 2.0 a go too? Cordless and waterproof, perfect for those dads with a little bit too much hair up the nose. So go to Manscaped today and use code Wildrum at checkout for 20% off and free delivery. Thanks to Manscaped for sponsoring the video. And it was back to work, building my heli tower. Oh, this is so high up that it's getting so unstable. I actually have no idea if these windows are going to work. Am I going to be able to place them there? Come on. Let's actually get some light up here so I can see. There we go. Okay, we'll make that sheet metal because I don't want anyone soft siding in. Nice. Okay, come on. Let me place all these roofs. Oh, it's getting so unstable up here. Okay, nice. I can place that. Ooh. Okay, now I'm struggling. What about with a frame? That should work, right? Yes! What about this last one? Another frame? Cool. Let's go! It works! Right, I'm gonna leave the middle ones as solid walls so I can have another bed with a locker up here too. I think that would be huge if I'm getting raided, having a locker right up here. I just need a ladder on each side. I'm also going to need ladder hatches there. Would be really helpful. But look at that. We have a little heli tower. And now with the heli tower, I can put on a wind turbine. And I can finally have a lot of electricity to power all of my turrets. Hey. <laughs> it only took all night to do it. But I've done it. Okay, that looks badass. No one can tell me otherwise. <laughs> this is the coolest shooting floor I've ever built. Alright, let's get this whole middle floor sealed up now. Okay, and then here we can have the jump up to uh, the kind of roof. I don't know, I have so many roofs at this point. <laughs> Yes, sir, we got the Tokyo Tower developed. <laughs> oh, this base is fire, honestly. We got the the inner peaks here, like the inner peak down shooting floor. The full circle, very cool. Got a bedroom here with a locker and some kits. Come down here, we got our core. With the electric furnace set up. Boxes. Leads down to the core. You got this chute here that can take you all the way to the top, it can take you to the peaks, or just down to the front door, which is so helpful. Got a little shop here. That <laughs> base is looking so cool. And then in each of these little gatehouses, I've got the uh, the bed with the vending machine, and then the hidden locker behind it. Bro, I'm so ready if anyone comes for me, man. Alright, let's get a look at this base from the outside. 
Oh, okay. You know what? That actually looks menacing. That is a badass solo base right there. <laughs> I love that heli tower, man. <laughs> hey, definitely got the best base right now. Frost, fuck you. My base is better. Get an L9 on that shooting floor for all that roof camping. <coughs> I mean, base defending I'm going to be doing. Right, I think I need a turret right there. Perfect. Fuck! <laughs> After that little accident, I was in need of some more cameras and laptops for turrets to defend my base. I headed to Sewer Branch to run the green car. What's Mr. Wetsuit Man got for me? Oh, he had a camera. Let's go. That's one step towards another another turret. Ooh. Oh, that guy was actually recycling a lot. Okay, 175 scrap. That will do. I'm gonna get that home. There she is, the beautiful creation. <laughs> With the blue card from Sewer Branch, I headed straight towards treatment to run the puzzle and get myself a red card. Unfortunately, it was already looted, so I kept running into the snow beyond. When I heard something interesting. Ooh, rockets, what's that? Fuck it, this time of day, I'm gonna go to that, that could be interesting. Is that from where the raid was? I'm not sure it is, but I feel like I should go to that anyway. Oh, wait, what? I was about to shoot that guy. Wait, they're not even together? They're not. That was the weirdest timing. I'm just gonna let these two fight and then clean up after them. Oh shit, Pizza guy just popped off! <laughs> oh no! I almost felt bad about countering that. Oh well. Footy for me? Oh. oh, second time today. I am farming the farmers right now. Who says Will Jim's a farmer? I'm a PvP chad now. What can I say? Oh, I'm actually kind of relieved that guy wasn't also full of farm. That would have made me sad. Well, I was going to go counter that raid, but with two rows of metal and a jackhammer, I feel like that would be uh, rather irresponsible of me. Well, another good farming run done, I guess. 2k frags in there, got some more in there, lovely stuff. Oh, 2k sulfur too, that finally cooked up. Filling up boxes right now. To keep the charcoal smelting for gunpowder, I took my chainsaw and quickly farmed some wood. Farming with a wood tea feels like playing on a modded server, man. Nice. Another inventory of wood. And after farming some wood, I took a quick break to grab some food. And when I returned, it seemed as though some of the others had come back online. Well, look at that. Blueprint and Frost are on. Not sure about h -Gene, but... Let's go say hi. Wait, looks like Blueprint's farming. He's got no idea I'm online. I'm gonna go scare him. <laughs> I'm gonna go rock him. <laughs> I'm sorry, Blue. Wait, behind you, behind you! How goes it, Blue? How long have you been on? Yo, check it out. I got the horses. Hell yeah. Uh, I don't know, like an hour. Uh, I think I'm going to train with like grub gear if you're down. Yeah, I'm happy to go on a little adventure. All right, let's do it. Uh, chuck me like a water pipe or something, and I can. I got across already. You're not. You're not 
taking a pipe, bro. No? That's what I mean by rub gear here. Just take my custom. Oh, for real? Alright, alright. We, we clearly have very different meanings of the word grub. <laughs> well, I, I don't mean kind of grub where we don't stand a chance. Uh, you, you do have a point. Well, that's my favorite type. And so as nighttime fell, Blueprint and I embarked on our own little duo mission to counter train yard. Uh, Blue, we are being chased by a guy with a glowing hat. I wonder where he is. Bro, that is so stupid, man. Oh, I couldn't even see him. Damn, crate's gone. That is a shame. That crate was there for a while, too. From the start of our adventure, one group had been terrorizing H-June all throughout the wipe. Yes, that very same group who we stole the LR and AK from on the first day, if you remember that. Blueprint and I decided to head over their base to give it a scout, just in case we decided to do something about it. Can't really see it right now because it's night, but... Wait, yeah, I hear, I hear footsteps. Yeah, they're still online, wow. Do you, do you wanna, do you have any more markers? Yeah, that's a good idea. It's like that four man that's just been pestering them all. Yeah, over. yeah, I thought it was. Wait, there's a mini. My blue is landing. What the fuck? You gonna shoot? I got a headshot. I didn't even, I couldn't even really see them. Wait, wait, they missed. Dead. He killed him, he killed yeah, him. Yeah, cross behind, cross behind. Oh, I'm getting compound boot as well. No. Yeah, this is not looking good. Dude, if we were on this side of the compound when they were flying in all slow like that. Yeah, that would have been perfect. Oh, I can't believe we're he fell now, inside. Really oh, yeah, yeah, this is going to be tough. I'm headshot dead to a combo. Oh, you're joking. I'm, I'm going like to lose you. Yep, I'm hit by a crossbow. Oh, my gosh. And I'm dead to a DB. Okay, what? Where are these guys coming from? So we had died at the base, but we now had a good idea of what we were dealing with. A honeycomb 2x2 two two base with more than four living inside. Like Blueprint and I regrouped and headed back. Just... Yeah, these guys just have like perfect roof camp. Yeah, I can see how they've, uh, Vision on his base. Yeah, I can see why they would have been a problem for H-Tune. They are literally right opposite him, and they're roof camping with an LMG. Fuck, man. Yikes, that feels bad. He's dead, I'm super low. Nice. I will go grab that SAR so I've got something to use instead of a P2. Was he hazy baiting or just naked? Yeah, hazy baiting. They got build up all over their base. It's a fully sheet metal base, so it'd be like... Four rocket the walls, and then we'd be um, eight rocketing the sheet metal, and then armored for another 16. So. Yeah, so we need at least like 40, 50 rockets, I guess. I feel like we should just pummel it. We build raid base like right in that clearing, 20. Yeah, yeah, that would be a good idea. <laughs> this is gonna be exciting, man. So a plan was forming. Today, we would aim to help H Tune out by grouping up to take down an enemy. What is Frost doing? Is he on I was horse? just thinking that. I was like, Where, where's he going? <laughs> He's going on an adventure. If we were to carry out this raid, there were a lot of preparations to be done, and we would all have to contribute our own parts. We hopped on a train and headed home. Little did we know, we were headed into trouble. Wait, 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 wait. Stop, stop, stop. These guys are using refinery over here. Tommy dead? Oh my gosh, that guy did not want to die. Is the base up here active with furnace? Would you be able to cover roof real quick? Yeah, yeah, roof is easy. Oh, 400 crude oil, that is literally what I needed. Okay, we've got to okay. get out of here. How long do you stack? How long do you stack? Oh, on me, on me. I'm down, I'm dead, I hit him three oh, times. Dude. Dead. He just destroyed me. Ah shit, I'm on my way. Oh shit, looks like Frost is on his way. He might be able to help. He's in the roof. I had like killed him. Killed him. I, I think that was the guy. Killed one on the back side of the uh, base of the gun. Back side of furnace base. Oh look who it is! It's Frost. Okay, I you found a lot of stuff. 
Killed another guy on me, running away. Go to the back side of that furnace base, Wildrum. You could safely loot a body there. Let me know what that guy had. Okay, okay, will do. He was naked with gunners. Oh, oh, wait, shit, this is blueprint stuff. I should leave that. Uh, okay, I got an MP5. Holy shit, that hurts. I think I killed him. Okay, nice, nice. After re-securing the loot, it was time to get out of this hellhole. We headed back. That was until Frost had an idea that we unknowingly agreed to. While we're down here, um, you want to go check to see if my launcher is still in the stash from Wipe Day? Uh, sure, yeah, back. as long as it's close. And now we were helping Frost find his stash from Wipe Day, and inside it was a rocket launcher. One that we would need for the raid ahead. Bro, there's no way that stash is still gonna be here on the water. No way, man. Dude, how fucking far is that? I thought you said it was the something. You said right in the water down here. Yeah, Frost, you have just taken us on a very long way out of route home. What the hell, man? Okay, okay, okay. Fuck, dude. It's like there was a bush. It should be like in this stump. Oh, Frost, we gotta get out of here, man. Yeah, yeah, one dead, one dead. Dude, please! Bro, I can't see him! Oh, on me, on me, on me. I'm down, I'm down. Uh, I just hit him once. Oh shit, there's more! Oh, what the fuck? Oh, I'm just down, I'm down, you can get me. Headshot him. Getting shot by someone else and I'm down. No! Yeah, kill one, kill one. Kill the guy that was behind the wall. Blueprint and Frost were down. It was just me left. Oh, I'm getting sawed from like a million miles away, dude. I have no meds for you, but I have a saw and a hazzy and some ammo. That's literally all I have. One's full dead. Nice. Down on the shore. There's another one, though. Twice. Three times on him. Are you good? Down. Shit. He's in that bush. Yeah, he's behind a node. I'm getting sawed. Oh, you killed him, you killed him. Oh my gosh, he had everything from the fight. He had a row of guns. Okay, Can I res you? Maybe. I'm gonna try. Down and down. Killed a saw on me. He's what is this? Me. No, I can't get to you. Fuck. God, I'm like pinched between five different people. Okay, I, I'm gonna try and go. No. Oh. There's a roof camper on me. What the fuck? Why? Okay. I'm running. Checking I'm running. That dude has M39 up there. Is that in the base? Get me out of here! Did we even find the stash? No, I don't think we did. I'm looking for it. <laughs> I can't believe Frost's stash was literally in the middle of a fucking war oh. zone. Like, what are the chances? Wait, what the fu- Oh, someone's raiding right next to me! Bro, I just need to get home. What is going on? Oh my god. I would not have put money on making that back alive. Wow. Jesus, that was insane. So I had made it out of the chaos alive. And even better, after it all died down... Oh my god, I got it. Frost found his Holy stash. God. The stash? It's here, yeah. No way, what the fuck? Because <laughs> it doesn't really matter anymore since you have one. <laughs> yeah, well, no one needs to know that. Yeah, yeah, guys, I found it! Let's go, we can raid! Fun what? Fun what? <laughs> we can raid! <laughs> Oh Link my god, you got a launcher? Now we can Dude, wait. Now we can wait. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Holy shit, good job, Frost. Now, while we were obviously being sarcastic, as we did already have a launcher, this second launcher Frost got made raiding that base one bit easier. I had literally two rows of guns. Blue, I can give you and a few And we went out on this expedition, and there was like literally 80 fucking human beings yeah. out there. And you know, we, we would have been fine, but Frost is like, Nah, guys, let's go get my stash. It's right over there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, because I knew you were going to let this fucking zone in all of Russia. Sends us on a fucking mission. Listen, through, like, I have recordings. I said B-23. It's not my fault. You guys are deaf. Eventually, dude. Okay, I'm instantly gone. <laughs> Lunar. 
Up till now, we'd been competing for progression, while obviously helping each other out where we could. But now our goals had changed. With one common enemy, we had to work together to take them down. It was time to get to work. Got one of them blue. Four hits, he's not dead, what the? Uh, Blue, there's a guy in between us two right now that you can probably kill quite easily. Yeah, I'm here. Yeah. Dead. Nice. Luna, this guy that just killed you. Yep. Can we, like, can I see screenshots of, like, what everyone's gear is kind of looking like? But, like, your soul for, yeah, like, what's that looking like for everybody? Like, we, we would have to go to, like, snow and then... I have a fair yeah, bit. Send, send me screenshots of your soul. Yeah, I could definitely contribute to the rockets. Mine's literally just 2k GP. I have a row of GP and like almost two rows of cooked sulfur. Okay, so you have quite a bit. That's that's good. Me and Wiljum were outside of their base, uh, trying to like just get an idea of what it looked like, and we got compound bowed by some random grubs that just were there. Okay, I have like 4k GP and a row and a half of sulfur, so I'll be able to contribute something. I think I'm gonna go make a base by the Is that I think I'm just gonna start uh, getting to work mixing this then. There's no one around my base except these fuckers. Hey, don't worry, H. We'll get him, man. We'll get him. I went to snow, kill like seven people with MP5. And then I come back with like a row of guns. And then they're just all there. Like all four, like, like four people with guns, naked DB, like fucking everything. I did kill them like 40 minutes before that fight in train yard. But that means they were waiting for me the entire time I was fighting in snow <laughs> at my base. Oh yeah, I love me some dog shit. <laughs> can't even place this, dude. HG was building a farm base, and we were preparing explosives. Until... Guys, guys, crate at airfield. Do you guys want to come? Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Fuck yeah, let's do it. Crate at oh, That's shit. First time as many times as I need to come back, so... <laughs> I'm in tower. I don't know why it wasn't taken. The door was closed. Okay, there's a hazy guy in the, the center tower. Yeah. Uh, I'm getting myself on top of the hangar. Three guys in the center tower. Oh, fuck, dude. I said, hey, I'm holding the tower. You hold the bottom, we'll work together, because there's a DVD below me, that's how I said it. And he's instantly like, okay, Frost? <laughs> Dude, if you talk in that <laughs> voice, like, that's more recognizable than the other voices. <laughs> Can't do that. Oh my god. I headshot hit him, but he headshot hit me. I'm low. Ah, headshot the guy tower. I cannot kill any of them. Good. It's just main tower building. I'm in the uh, main tower where it's at. Buildings across the airfield. I'm in the tower close to the plate. Oh I have my a pretty gosh. Good view on it, so I'll probably get the pick on the guy looting. Yeah, I, we'll I'm do doing it. a lot of damage, but they're also doing some damage to me. There were three enemies in the main tower, but Frost was hidden in the second tower, and they didn't yet know he was there. I was continuing to draw down their meds. Double headshot one. Lit. Nice. Shot hit hit, one's down in there. Okay, cool. I don't see any right now. Oh. Headshot one. Hit the other one. Gosh, these guys just have unlimited meds, man. As the crate timer ran down, we would have to make our move. Hit them three more times? Bro, they gotta be so low on me. I'm getting owed? Are you three. serious? There oh might gosh. be three, so I think it's two in the tower, but there might be another lurking, so be careful. Well, there go all of my meds. One dead. Nice. Can we do the little crack? I hear someone below. Is that you? Oh, okay. That's me, that's me, that's me. I don't see anything. Three times on him? He's one nice. HP. I'm going up. I'm coming. Killed him? Oh my gosh, you're nice. insane. Get a pump in my face, how does he not kill me? Oh my gosh, Blue, you just killed them all, you're crazy! This guy had none Oh here. my god, this crate was the best one we got. What is it? AKLR? Damn, good job. Nice. You just jacked all my loot? Oh shit, there's a guy out there. After giving Frost my AK on the very first day, he now returned the favor and gave me the one he got in the crate. We all headed home our separate ways. People, Wait, people's someone right? bought something from my shop, let's go! Oh shit, they bought another 7 diesel, let's go, 150 high quill. Nice. Wait, and they bought garage doors! I got 20. I got 225 scrap! 
After getting the AK home, I wanted to set up some more turrets. Does anyone know exactly how many turrets you can run on one windmill? Like a max? 85. 85 turrets? Yeah. What? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, <laughs> what the fuck does this dude say? Whatever the max battery is, you can you can run all of it. Do you need siren light? I can craft you one. Ah, uh, no. Nah, I gave you one. I got turrets in the compound. I should be fine. I took a quick break for a coffee, meanwhile Agetune and Blueprint headed off to the snow to farm more sulfur. At the same time, Frost had been to Outpost to buy a minicopter. Minicopters just change everything. Dude, you realize the map is so small when you get a minigun? <laughs> it's like... Wait, that guy had an M39, what? Hey, bro. Oh my gosh, sewer branch is crazy. I just got pumped in the mouth on the world. While roaming around Sewer Branch in my area, it appeared that another group had also moved in. This could be a problem. I look the other way. I oh no, that wasn't good. Oh, hurry, I need my you can't do the thing and then complain about it. Oh my gosh, this is a four man. Oh, it's a four man. Yep. Oh, I'm out of ammo! Oh no! Oh! I've already got pop slugs! Oh, I'm so sad. Four man down! Oh, huge! He had a camera. It's another old turret. Let's go! After clearing out some of my area, it was time to contribute some farm for myself. I headed out with the jackhammer to farm some sulfur. You guys have MLR, so I have MLR module and this rocket. Yeah, I have three on me and a module as well. Oh shit, yeah, we should definitely use MLRS, it would help a lot. I mean, that, that would be low-key good to take Yeah, 100%. I think, I think we should use it. Yeah, them. yeah, yeah. Even if we just kill them on the roof, or maybe break turrets. As nighttime came, Blueprint flew over with a minicopter to collect some sulfur and charcoal. He was currently the only one with the explosives Blueprint, so we had to give him the resources to craft the rockets. He continued this run with Frost and Aishun, collecting sulfur from all of us. We were getting closer to our goal. Good luck, soldier. Get that home safe. Now, the good guy right by Frost Base. I mean, he's only P2, but. Good man? P2 Bumpy. Yeah, there's another guy on me, what? Oh, uh, I might be dead. Another sour on me. Jackie farmers could be worth. I can make sure my that might both dead. <laughs> I am better. You killed them both. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Four bullets kill the Nice. Ooh, that got some good farm. While roaming through my area, I was seeming to run into more and more grubs. Why are there so many people around my base? I gotta go on a raiding spree. I think I need to start getting satchels. I headed home to craft up some molotovs and boom, with the intention of raiding some of my neighbors. Ah, sheet metal door. Right, I'm gonna go get some satchels and finish that off. I crafted up four satchels to finish off the sheet metal door. And while on my way back to finish the raid, I got a shout from Blueprint. Mm, they might have some charcoal. I think it's worth for one rocket. I got the boom right here. Well, well, I literally have four satchels on me right now. I can come right away. Let's just do it. Take these grenades. There's another door. Oh my god, they have a fucking tier two. Well, I can oh, look at his invent! 
Bro. What was in it? No way. It was like a row of metal ore. All right, Here, back uh, up, back up. I got full satchels on me. Yeah, yeah, good. I'm making door code lock. Wait, wait, wait. Frames wood. Frames wood. Hold up. Oh, blue. Careful. God damn, blue. Yeah, that was some. Uh, that was some balls there. Just throw two more. Just throw two more, and I'll, 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 I'll explosive ammo. Yeah, right. okay, okay. Don't, don't throw. That shit quite a lot. You see is oh my gosh, look at the comps. What in the world? These guys were loaded. Did you clear already? I got Molly on me. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me back up. Let me get to see. Damn, did you guys see that comp box? Damn, no charcoal. That is a shame. A lot of crude. You guys need crude? <laughs> No, well that was a profitable raid. We all ended up with full inventories for raiding just a little three men. I'm gonna set up my third blank base, dude. That's Bullets. Oh man, why is my raid such a bust? <laughs> she got nothing. That is such a shame. Guys, are still online. They probably are. I don't see any movement, but there's definitely a light on inside their base. The time now was 1 a.m., 53 hours from the start of our white. Preparations were at full steam, and we were getting ready to raid H. June's number one enemy. But just as our rocket count was starting to hit our goal, Blueprint spotted a group of full kits jumping into a 2x2 two -two base next to Sewer Branch. The same group who I had killed earlier, just outside of my base. This was an opportunity we could not pass up. We kitted up and decided to gamble, investing some of the rockets we'd crafted up into this one target. What are you bringing? Uh, LR stack of ammo. I'm good to go. Coming out now. I'm gonna be close, I'm just gonna try Cause to... I'm gonna be like, mollying their front door so they won't be able to do shit. Let me know if you're gonna shoot. Here, uh, Wiljum, take these grenades. You can just toss them in there when I breach. Yeah, all right. Might be There's a rock right here I can get on. No, it's farther. And the door's facing the forest southwest. He's, he's, in, get the, up on he's them, in the twig on the airlock, the twig like windows. Okay, you can initiate or do whatever you need to do. I'm on the left now. There's a no, I'm gonna shoot, I'm gonna kill him, I'm gonna kill him. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. One dead, one dead. Shot at me. You're dead? Yeah, you have to pick me up. Shit, okay, I killed one. Yeah, yeah, I hit him a bunch too. I'm in the bushes, you can pick me up. I'm heading. I killed that one! Oh! Be careful, Blue. You've got all the rockets on you. I'm four rocketing. Back up. Yeah, yeah. Can you med me once? Thank you. We opened up the base, and it seemed like we had full control. Little did we know, this wasn't their only base. This was not over. Okay, yeah. Uh, can you get that armor in there? I dropped it, I dropped it. I think he's dead, I think he's dead. Nice, nice. I'm watching these bags. Can you, can you get those bodies in there? Yeah, yeah, I've looted the bodies in the airlock. I got it all, just watch bags in here, watch bags. Here, take a ladder. You good? Take take ladder, take ladder. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, dead, dead. Nice. nice. You nice. wanna go out there, Frost? Yeah, I can't jump out though. There's multiple guys coming from the compound. One, one shot shot. It appeared as though this group were allied with the very same group that Blueprint and I had tried to take on for the airdrop on the first day. Ooh. I gotta get out there and seal. Dead. One far, one far. Oh no, I got stuck on the ladder. Fuck, man. Nine iron. It's the same guys as the airdrop. I had to throw your what? Shirt on the With too much loot on the line to lose, I kitted up and headed straight back. Kill the full metal. Kill one full dead. Full dead. Nice, nice, nice. I'm dead. I got. I got to respawn. Oh my gosh, there are still more in there. Okay, the dead, oh, there's fire. another. I'm dead. There are so many. Dead, dead, dead. Nice. It's clear in here. They had a door. I'm securing them. They can't come in now. Big, big, big. 
Good job, good job. Oh, there's oh, satchelings, there's satchelings. Oh, shit. I'm opening this door. Okay. I'm opening this one. I'm on my way back, I'm on my way back. I closed the other door? Okay, I can definitely spray a couple. If any of you guys are ready? Yeah, dude, if you can spray a couple, I'll go to the roof. I'll go to the roof. Okay, one full dead. Uh, oh my gosh, there's so many! Coming, 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 coming. I'm dead. Two dead. Nice. Let's go, let's go. I don't know if I down one or two. While Blueprint and I had died, Frost had managed to hold the raid down and given us time to come back and clear the outside. It appeared as though we had won. <laughs> this is either the, like some random in. secondary base or like they're allied with the people who were building it. Damn, they came out AK. Hit him once. He's dead, he's dead. AK dead. Nice. Yeah, yeah, let's, let's loot that shit. 100%. Yeah. I was trying to pack the blue, yeah, and I bagged you. Wait, so how far did they blow in when they were raiding the base back? Ooh. Wait, that one? Oh my gosh. I got one satchel for free. Holy fuck. They got so close. We filled up our inventories with loot from the base, and they were absolutely loaded. All of these kits would help us take on the final enemy, H-Tune's group. After clearing the outside one more time, we headed home with all of the riches. Yeah, we're just going back to base. Bye, everybody. It was a fun raid. <laughs> Here, you take the horse, Jun. You take the horse. Time was ticking on, and we were nearly there. The final chapter. The raid was closing in. Being the builder, I volunteered myself to prepare the raid base. Our plan was beginning to come together. We would use H. June's base as our location of operation. Blueprint would be our dedicated rocketeer. Frost, being the sneaky devil that he was, would take to the mountain and use a silenced L96 to cover while we raid. And H-Tune would be the all-rounder. He'd cover with his AK and use his launcher if he needed. And so, let the plan begin. In my own base, I gathered everything I could to build the perfect raid base that will give us both offensive and defensive capabilities. Onlining a group of four or more players, a strong raid base was crucial. How do I get up to your roof? Is, can I get up there with the code locks? Okay guys, I think I have everything I need. I will just need a pickup to get to H-Tune's base. When you guys get the chance, check this board. Basically, like, I've drawn out how we should be building the raid base and how we should set up our high walls. Because if we do a full loop, then the turret's useless. Mm -hmm. But if we do a funnel, then anyone yeah, trying to I door agree. camp gets on the get fucked plan. So place the walls, because then there's the risk of, like, a grub will find his way in there and, and just hold it. That's why I say we do this at, like, night, far away enough that he doesn't hear. I hopped on the minicopter, ready to head to h -Tune's base, which is when the worst thing possible happened. Well, yeah, they saw me on roof with launchers. No way. They had been sitting on their roof and had spotted Blueprint on Agetune's base with a launcher. The gig was up. The element of surprise was most likely lost. We would now be fighting an uphill battle. Okay, I'm gonna depot everything in here and go home. So do you want to four rocket then shoot high and break their shooting floor then? Oh no. I feel like we just pour it. That's what I'm saying, yeah. Cloth, I have the tier two, but what about low grade and cloth and shit? We had initially planned on raiding as the sun rose, but now they knew, our odds were looking unlikely. They were on their roof, snipers at the ready, aimed right towards H-Tune's base. Now begun, the wasting game. Dude, that drone was actually like so bad. Yeah, I can't believe they droned you. Oh man. What are we gonna do? It was clear they knew something was up, and that a raid was potentially imminent. We knew that outnumbered, if we attempted to take them head on, we would surely lose. We had to catch them by surprise, but what could we do? And so now begun the mind games. We waited, and we waited. Even at night time, they in. were looking around. Yeah, they are so ready right now. Everyone has a bed? I have a bed. Try your best to just like not show yourself at all. Because the less they see, the less they think is going on. And with some more waiting, another night time passed. It seemed as though the mind games were working. They'd lost patience and had come to h -Tune's base to investigate. Oh yeah, I hear like two or three in the compound age. They wanna know what's going on. Oh, they're trying to take the mini. 
Bro, I can't shoot them. Can't get him? H? Wait, what? H shoot? I hit him three times. He's not dead. He's dead, he's dead, he's dead. Oh no. Wait, no Wait, what? Oh, this is bad. Full <laughs> naked. Oh dear. The heli didn't break though. After waiting a full day cycle, we planned on hitting on this new morning. And Frost headed out first on his own with his silenced L9 kit. He'd post up on the mountain and be a menace throughout the raid. Like right, absolutely right now. I'm dead, I'm dead. What? No. He just Ow. died to a bear. He just died to a bear. Just no, I'm getting full inventory of shit. Can anyone else go? I I'm full, I can't go out. I have all the build stuff. He's on me, he's on me, flashlight. Okay. No, dude. The other dude had night vision. He was across the road, he's dead. Once again, disaster had struck. As well as the players on the roof, they'd had two players on the road hiding in the bushes with night vision. And just like that, we had lost the L96 and Frost's plan. Bro, these guys are pissing me off. They haven't roamed or done anything in like four hours. They just sit and roof camp and wait. Yep, it's there you go. On his roof L9. Oh, that's their L9. <sighs> and Frost, Blueprint, and I found this annoying. But just think, this is what H-Tune had been dealing with since the very start of Wipe. This group did nothing but sit by their base, roof camp, and run to train yard. And they were online the entire time. And despite H-Tune's successful attempts taking them on, they never even tried to raid him. We just had to watch their base crumble. No, yeah, I see him, I see him, I see him. He's in front of me. Yourself. I killed someone right in front of me. Arctic has he. Bro, that's so stupid, dude. Yeah, that is really annoying. <sighs> the fact they were just wasting in the that's, bush. That's literally how they play. Knife is so annoying. Man, that's scuffed. That plan was actually like a good plan. Wait, I was running across the road and I just saw two green eyes in the bush across the road. Just Once again, it was back to the waiting game. But on this day, they were even more aware than the last. So, we waited. See, it was starting to get late. And the longer we waited, the more they would relax. And all it would take is just one moment where they're not paying attention, and we could strike. We're gonna have to have one person raid base, all three of us transfer rockets together. What are we doing for MLRS? Uh, I have it. I, I just respawn over there and do it when the raid base yep, is finished. Okay. Fuck it. Let's fucking do it, boys. Are we ready? Yep. We, we build right here. I'm gonna put wall here and then you build on the other side, okay? With one player on the roof, we had seconds before he turned and noticed. And then we put turret here on a sheet metal foundation. Still not looking, still not looking. I'm 356. Bruh. Just on subset? Yeah, I'll get boxes down. Like, refix the turret and then just run back down. Two? I have, I have off. Wait, we should get rock. We should get rockets before yeah, you Yeah, 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 we should, the we should. They might hit. Yeah, 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 exactly. Wait, roof, he's on roof! He doesn't see us. What the fuck, he's blind! You can you see There's us? no way, he's on the roof. But he didn't see us? Wait. Oh, he is blind. He is no Did he blind. still not see us? Fuck, man. What? I cannot believe that the MLRS would be No, he has not Wait, he seen hasn't us seen us. He's literally blind. What the fuck? No, he just, dude, he's tunnel vision fucking electricity right now. Everything was in place. We were just wasting on Blueprint's MLRS. Oh, shit. Wait, he's going up. He's going up. He's on the roof. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, oh. Oh shit! Nice hit, nice hit. Nice, we got walls, big. I think they know now! Alright, let's get started. Alright, yeah, yeah, we can just start moving on that. He's peeking left side. Headshot. Nice shot, nice shot. Reloading. We hit their hop up. <laughs> that, that, what are nice, you nice, doing? Nice. Alright. I got a hit marker. Watch out, watch out, give me one. That, that might be gone soon. Up. Up. He's almost dead. 
Hit him twice, twice. Yeah, 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 nice. I have no visual. Nice. Yeah. That's bad. Is okay, the getting it broken in the compound? It's like so weird. Let's go. Let's go. I'm gonna do both. Dead, dead. Wiljum, tell, tell me if he's going to breach. You yeah, dude, roll, roll, roll after rockets. There's tier three. Oh I'm grabbing these. Oh, I'm grabbing yeah, these. Nice, nice, nice. And two stacks of exploring. Dead outside. Oh, oh, right here. Whole box of guns, dude. AKs and shit. Holy shit. Chow, he's opening the door. Hey, open this up for me. There's rocket. There's people coming. I'm gonna rocket that. I'm gonna. Oh, no. I'm going to deep bomb. Someone behind the external. Yeah, and twice. I need med. One dead outside. One on the right, dead. Right? I'm dead. I'm dead. Wait, wait, wait. I'm on roof, roof, roof. Yeah, roof, roof. I'm gonna, I'm gonna load the car. Just the floors. Peaks, peaks. I don't have a key. Only one with movement. A guy on the roof, by the way. Upstairs. Yo, boost me. Hit him. Hit him. In once. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, that hatch. Drop down, drop down. Slow. Mid, mid floor, mid floor. He's it's right all up above that. Nice, nice, nice. He's, he's like the floor above that. There are two up there, by the way. Go. Nice. Ladder hatch. I don't need to. Don't boost me up there. Boost me up there. I think he's dead in ladder hatch. I think he's dead in ladder hatch. Four hits. H. Okay, one. I'm trying to think he's a Someone below, someone below, someone below. Uh, we'll fed by our base. You open this? Hey, okay, did it in. Nice, good shit. Kit here, like a, uh, a, a fucking locker. Okay. Wolf heads running. Jackhammer or anything? Okay. I got a satchel, I'm gonna blow this. Okay, yeah, do that. Uh, another L9. There's your L9, Frost. Sweet, dude. Can I have it? <laughs> Can I have it? He just sealed us in. Oh, wait. Watch out left. Watch out left. Going, go, going. Oh, yeah, stop him. I'm trying to stop him. Oh, there's a box of guns here. Did we not yeah, yeah, yeah. I was we already going to that. Wait, 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 wait. I'm making a double door so we can clear main loot. Wait, we can probably secure right now. Yeah, we make, yes, we can, we can. Dude, I don't care, like, we're full wiping these kids. It's free. Oh my god, this battery has 6,000 charge, that's for my fucking That's huge for you, Jesus Christ. Like, I, it just disappeared, I know. I got it, I got it. Oh, good shit, guys. Good I could have went way shit. different if we did that earlier, so. Good shit, yeah, that was, that was insane. Bro, we fucking killed him, man. Well, they were ready to hop on. It's just the one guy they had ready to fucking call him on. Somehow <laughs> missed an entire raid base being built right next to him. Oh, they're going to be so mad at him. In Dude, the, there's the so much wood. Actually, so silly. They would rather just uh, roof camp, I guess. We looted that box of guns before we sealed it, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm going up top to, to Like, they have room. rows of AKs, and they just roam like Tommy. It's so weird. And with the base fully ours, we had moved all the loot to our raid base. Let's have a look at what we got. You got it. You sealed it off. Is that cool? No, we didn't. Oh, my. <laughs> what the fuck? Bro, they just, they had so much, and they still played like such bitch. Oh, my, these guys, they anger me. But we wiped them, and that's all that matters. <laughs> yeah, do it. Dude, good job, everybody, all around. Like, oh, yeah, shit. that was a good job, everybody. We all had our roles, we did our parts, and that was a damn successful raid. Yeah. yeah, that, yeah everything yeah. transferred? Well, I think so. Everything that we needed. Everything was solid. Taking our portion for ourselves. Yeah, honestly. Yeah, I've got camera too. I want to be fair. I want to be fair, dude. <laughs> I will take one turret. Dude, fuck fairness, dude. <laughs> fuck fairness. <laughs> all right, I'm shooting you off, dude. This is my <laughs> <laughs> I'm inciting everyone here. This is my shit now. <laughs> Holy shit. I changed the codes. I'm fuck you all. This is my base now. <laughs>
And you can recycle now, June. They're gone. You can recycle. That's true. Oh, Holy oh, shit. June, I can't believe you were dying to these trash cans, bro. I would have been <laughs> yeah, these imagine. guys every time. Honestly, if it was just me, fucking they'd be gone, man. You just kill like six guys. They all just W key me because their base is right there. They have like nine bags around train yard. The bag system is so stupid, bro. It is, man. It is. Do you think that there should be longer range between outside bags? I've got an absolute truck ton of yeah, me too. rockets on me. Yeah. Oh, I don't. Well, this is easy because we could kind of all yeah, go the three of us. Yeah, well, and yeah, H, we can escort H and then go the rest okay. of us. My base first. Hey guys, you realize h is gonna make like four loot runs by the time we make it back. We'll get back and the base will be empty. <laughs> uh, he's dead. Okay. We took all of their stuff, right? We did. Like, yeah. Everything in the yeah. base is pretty much yeah. gone. Okay, good, good, good. We're gonna go go back and grab a bunch of stars. Yeah, and I'm just gonna those. grab frags. Oh yeah, so I'll Oh, sell charcoal! Shit, I need true. to get to. Yeah. I'm gonna grab my horse and like I genuinely feel so so happy for you. Yeah. Ah, oh, honestly, guys, that was that felt good. I think that this was like a, I think this was a big success. Yeah, I I completely agree. I think so too. Yeah. I like I just I this general concept has been super fun, like and actually like enjoyable to play as well. Me I guess too. so. Because, like, as a solo and, like, doing your own wipe, you, you want to play a certain way. You want to flank this fight a certain mm -hmm. way. You want to, you know, build your own base. But when you play with groups, you know, that changes. You can't always do what you want to do. But, like, needing, like, having teammates readily available when you need it, you know, mm -hmm. and so to helpful. do things that, like, raids and stuff, it's, like, such a game changer, I, man. Oh, and yeah. it was really fun, yeah. this format. I really enjoyed it. I'd be down to do it again. I would do it again, sure. Oh, hold up. I killed a full AK guy. Just, oh, where? Where? Yeah. The server has been like, it's been nice. It's like, it's big, but it's not felt dead at any point, really. But it's not felt like we too much. Well, Jim, you gotta stop talking so highly of it in front of HG, bro. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I've, this, I've, I've hated every terrible, second man. of this, man. <laughs> this been it's dead. been dead. There's been no You've PvP. Been camped, I've been getting Yeah, sucks, yeah. I, I'm never coming back, man. For our challenge. But it was just these guys. I just got unlucky. Yeah. We continued to make some runs between the raid base and our own homes as we moved all of the loot securely. And you like i'm putting all the cloth i see gp low grade into the tc for you to grab h h i'm labeling two guns here an a or b and you have to choose a or b and you get one okay all right uh is it all tier three you're choosing between an l9 and a bolty Ooh. Ooh. i'm gonna go i'm gonna go brazy and pick b ah, you get the bolty Wait, I, oh, wait, wait, wait. I feel like whichever, yeah, 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 I feel like whichever you said, you were getting the pulse. That. <laughs> I, how am I supposed hey, to? I heard hesitation in that voice, bro. Yeah, I think that what was, was right. that? So I said, that was all right. You look at, look at. That's the thing. <laughs> no, that's where I put them. A is obviously the L9. I already, I already have one at base. I'll give you the L9. I'm actually kind of know what you mean. <laughs> that's true, because you guys are like one video, right? Dude. Yeah, dude, it's just too much, man. Especially when I have like such a strict deadline right now. I might not even be able to make it. Alright, I got everything I wanted from the raid base. The rest is whatever you guys want. Well guys, I'm probably just gonna do random base shit. Um mm -hmm. but and then like hop off pretty soon here. Move up stuff to my Same. cave. Um Me too. but fucking GG's guys. Like genuinely yeah, it's like the first time I've had fun in Rust for like a fucking while, so Same yeah, here. Oh <laughs> yeah, hell yeah. Wait, dude, yeah. base tours. Base tours. Oh, we, do we gotta. We don't do it tomorrow. I'll watch your video, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, <Blue. laughs> wow. I'll watch wow. your video. It's fine. Blue, Blue had the worst base anyway. He knows that. He okay. Knows. <laughs> and with the successful raid, we said our goodbyes. And for some of us, that would be the last time we played together on the server. But for me and one other solo, our adventures weren't over yet. In fact, we have one hell of a tale still to be told. Because we still had 40 hours left to be the last solo standing.